In this tutorial, create a concrete surface with puddles without using any textures added from the outside. First I will create the concrete material. This layout will give me a large space for the shader editor. Musgrave texture will give me large patchy areas. If you already have Node Wrangler enabled, just press Ctrl T and mapping will be automatically added, otherwise you will have to add it manually. Press Ctrl J to create a frame with these two nodes. I used noise texture to make the dots smaller. Combine these two patterns together with Mix RGB. Then use color ramp to adjust the color. I selected these notes and grouped them for easy management. On the water side I use glass BSDF. Now use mix shader to combine concrete and water. I use noise texture to divide the display area for these two materials. This division is too faint and I used color ramp to make these areas clearer. Now for the important part, use displacement to create the right terrain. Still nothing happens, of course, because it only works in cycles. You see, because glass needs the surrounding landscape to properly represent its reflective nature. So I will add the environment. The setting of the material must select displacement and bump. The last thing is that the plane must be subdivided in edit mode or use the subdivide surface in the modifier. The water is on top of the terrain, which is not true. I swapped two materials. Problem solved. You can create a lot of terrain by adjusting the parameters like I am doing. Hope it is useful for you. Thank you for watching the video.